Hi everyone, welcome back to Nessa's Nook. Today I'm going to do something. Um, I've been starting to do this probably for about the last year. I have a previous video of it showing it in my small KitchenAid um, stand or food processor. However, I don't do it that way anymore. What I'm going to need to do is I'm making a new batch of brown sugar. And um, it's very, very simple. I have not bought brown sugar in the store for well over five years. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to bring this down. And I have the KitchenAid bl Blade Scraper 1. I did buy this extra for this one. It didn't come with it. My old one did. But there is no measurements to this because it depends on how dark you like the brown sugar, how light, how light you like the brown sugar, or whatever. So what I'm just going to do is I'm going to just pour some sugar in here. This is probably about six cups, probably. And use up the rest of this molasses here. I made up some baked beans. I used up almost all that whole thing. There might be just a smidge left in there. And then I got a new jar here of molasses. And I think it works better and it just comes together so much better in the KitchenAid versus, let me see if I can't raise this up a little bit so you can see this better to actually put it down further. Yeah, that's probably better. Anyways, of course, like always, you don't start the, the KitchenAid on high because you'll be shoving everything every which way. But you can see it's already started to incorporate the brown sugar. And what it does is it just will mix the sugar and the brown sugar together in like hardly no minutes at all. See, I want mine a little bit darker than that. That's one good thing about doing it at home. You can figure out how much or how little you want. Try not to have my arm in the way. But there you go. That's a batch of brown sugar ready to go in your storage container. Super simple, huh? Anyways, I'll be using some of this brown sugar here in just a little bit. I found a recipe online today, and I so want to try it. So look forward to that. But this is the easiest way I know how to make brown sugar at home. Sugar, molasses, and then mix it. Now, you can mix it in your food processor. You can mix it by hand. I have found doing it in the KitchenAid, I think it's just much uh, easier, and it seems like the the color just goes through there a lot better. So thank you for stopping by and you have a very blessed and wonderful day.